All right, Rebecca says jail can be a lonely place. Ooh, Rebecca, you were in jail? Yes. Um, do you know the show Orange is the New Black? Yes. Hey, okay, well, it's not. Oh. It's, like, totally different. I just was in jail for 10 months. Yeah. And it's, like, you're in a pod with, like, 50-plus people. And yeah. you literally can't do nothing. Like, can't mess with no females, can't touch them. You're busy, like, all the time. Oh. So you're, like, in jail horny for no reason. Yeah. <laughs> and, yeah. Um, like... Yeah. We was in, I was off of the kitchen duty one day, and I, we watched your show a lot in jail. Oh. <laughs> oh. And I just want to wave to all our viewers in jail. <laughs> <laughs> and I was watching your show there one yes. day, and I seen my ex, Taylor, and his fiance on oh, your show. Oh, you're watching the show in jail, and your ex is on our show? Yes, with his fiance. <laughs> I mean, he was looking good and everything, but, you know. Yeah. Oh, what was he doing on our show? Getting married. Oh, oh. <laughs> Do we have that clip? Oh, well, let's see the clip. This is when your ex is on our show getting married to someone else. Yes. All right, let's see. Your best friend was there, and she had put some stuff in my head, and I'm really sorry, but me and her had slept together that night. Sorry, because I really do love you. Regardless of what, regardless of who she is or what she done, nothing, nothing can change the fact of how much, how much you truly mean to me. Because it was just me. <laughs> Will you marry me still? Yeah, but it's gonna take a lot to trust you. Oh. What a, what a romantic story. <laughs> You don't see that on Lifetime. <laughs> so, so, uh, oh, so he was marrying this other woman. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay, well, I had got out of jail in June. Yes. And I had actually seen Taylor at the store. Oh, so you bumped into it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And he was like, how are you? I was like, good, how's married life? And he was like, well, we're separated. Oh. And he was like, well, me, we should chill sometime. I was like, okay. So a couple days later, he chills with me and... We actually had a lot of sex, like, oh. Marathon of Fifty Shades of Grey, that bad. Oh, <laughs> oh my. And a couple of days after that, I see his wife at yeah. the grocery store. Yes. And she was asked, like, hey, girl. And I was like, hey. And she was like, um, how are you? I was like, good, how are you? He was like, she was like, you know, I'm married now, like, happily married. And I was, like, looking oh. at her confused, because I'm like, um, OK, because, you know, I was just sleeping with her yeah. husband yeah. a couple of days ago. <laughs> But, but she was telling you they're happily married. Yes, I was like kind of like confused about it and everything. Yeah. And then we started like hanging out more, and I started feeling guilty about everything. Oh, like sure. I was just yeah. sleeping with your husband, and you don't know about it. So I brought her on the show to tell her I slept with her husband. Oh. <laughs> now that you know they're married, do you want to be with him? No, that was just like I was out of jail and needed to have sex. Oh, I see. <laughs> yeah. So you, you're not interested in breaking up their marriage anymore no. or anything like that? You no. just want to let her know that what yeah. happened? Well, uh, she's outside the studio, so she hasn't heard any of this. We're going to bring her in. You'll tell her. Okay. Here's mm -hmm. Katie. <laughs> Katie, welcome back on the show. Jerry. Yeah. So, um, and how, how is, because on the show you got married, everything good? It's going great. We have our falls, but whatever, what, a, what marriage doesn't. Yeah, and it's now going okay. All right, well, good. You two know each other. What do you yes. want? Um, Katie, I have something to tell you. Like, you know me and, I don't know if you know, but me and Taylor dated, like, way before you. Hayes told me about it. Yeah, well, um, you know, I just got out of jail recently, and we kind of seen each other, and we had, like, a lot of sex. Oh! And I just wanted to let you know, because he was telling you, telling me that y'all was separated and y'all weren't together. When's the last time y'all had sex? About a week ago. <laughs> we just started hanging out a week ago. Yeah, that's why I brought you on here to, like, say I was sorry and try to tell you.
wipe for you. Whatever. So Nobody you're, what something. you're saying is you don't want to be with him. It's, no, I don't. It was just like I there. got out of jail and yeah. just kind of had sex. Don't want to. Did you have him. any reason to believe that he was cheating? Period. Not. No, her. Jerry. Yeah. Everything's going good. We. I literally just went and got us our own house. We move in November. Yeah. Well, I'll let you talk to him. Here he is. Here's Taylor. <laughs> But she took ring twice. Yeah, but she took twice. Not once, twice you cheat on me. You ain't loyal. Yeah, but still, you need to pipe your attitude down a little bit. Pipe my attitude down. I take care of you. I cook shepherd's pie, lasagna for your ass. I cook for your ass. Your ass in the studio every damn night. Guess what? Good job. You a wife. <laughs> you don't treat me like one. You treat me like I'm just a bitch. Hell. Uh, Still, you took your ring off you, you, like ten times, Jerry. Oh yeah. Like she, she like every, like every time we get in an argument, like she'll sit there and take, she'll be like, I'm done, I'm done, like walk off and throw her ring across the house or something. Like it, when you're married, that's a commitment. You take that yeah. ring off, you broke your loyalty. I broke my loyalty. I broke my loyalty. And the cheating is. I mean, yeah, because you know what I'm saying? Like, if she, it's like taking when your somebody, ring When off, somebody yeah. tells me they done, I'm about, to, I'm about to get back on my grind. I'm about to worry about me and my money. Yeah. Whatever I'm focused okay. on. Okay. Yeah. Like, you worried about your money? Where's the job at? Why are you making some bitch take Yo. care of you? Yo. Okay. You buy I just got you pimp over birthday. I got you house living. What do you do? Not a damn thing, Taylor. What am I supposed to do? Be a husband. Get a job. You want to have a kid? All right. How about this look? How about if you sit there saying get a job, do this, but how am I supposed to get a job if you live in the country and the closest job is way up the damn highway somewhere? Back in the day, you they used to walk, get a bicycle, do something. I left my family for you. What do I look like, Jerry? A fool? But she is, it's reasonable for her that yeah. now you're, you're married, you ought to go out and try to get a job. You're a healthy young man. Right. Go out and get a job. You know what I'm saying? I do our vows mean anything to you? Do they mean anything when you take their ring off? He's it obviously did. Ho! Try again. Oh. Oh. Other than that, which is not a small thing, the cheating, obviously. <laughs> but does he have a point that whenever you guys argue about anything, you kind of blow up and throw the ring and, you know, because I see you're pretty active out here. <laughs> so that could kind of make a guy think, geez, what, this is not a relationship Jerry, I want to be in. I'm 20 years old and this is yeah. my first marriage. I don't know yeah, it, the first thing about a marriage. You don't go into a marriage thinking it's your first. <laughs> you, <laughs> You know, it's... That's yeah, so all she's worried about herself. It's your own. I'm worried about myself. Yeah. Really? Like, you always come, always come on the and complain whenever I want to rap. You're like... Because you're up all night long. I like to sleep. I got to... What you mean? I'm putting in work. Work? Where's the money at? What you mean? You got to get there first and take steps. You got to start somewhere and then get okay. there. Okay. Like but you got to like realize... You. Like, I got bigger you dreams. You married. Like, obviously, we don't... You married you know, now. Obviously, we on the same level. Cause me, I dream of bigger. Like I, I got bigger dreams. You want to live in a damn a double wide or a, a modular a home? A double wide. That's why we're moving house in November. Wanna... Yo, for real, for real. Screw that house. I want a mansion. Okay. For real. I got bigger dreams. Y'all, I'm being you serious. Mansion, you want a mansion? You want I'm dedicated. I'm dedicated. Money takes it. So good. God, people. So, so, so where's your grind at? Where's my grind? I'm trying. You said I can get paid. My money goes towards rent, electric, phone bills. It's different. Wi-Fi. But you just got to sit on your ass and watch Lifetime while I'm out here doing What are you doing sitting in the bedroom on your ass rapping? Buddha, Buddha, Buddha. <laughs> All right. Look, you're a good guy. You guys obviously love each other. 
Yeah. But you got to spend five seconds thinking about <sighs> where is this going? And with you, it that's, really, a, that's the thing, though. I don't know where you it's have going. a beautiful big dream. Okay, no, no one's saying you shouldn't have your <sighs> dream, but it starts out by actually getting a job and working for it and then getting Thank you. doing better and better you you got to do that see, no I, do myself. I do everything myself i do i do everything i do my mixtape covers i do my mix and mastering every Jerry? But you got to go out and get a job in addition otherwise you have the money i mean you know the great artists they all start out with some job i also want you my know. name i also want my name to be on my face card to be good it'll be good but get you got to get a job i want to know that but you can <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm not saying yeah. stop your music. Pursue that. Yeah, I know, but see, But when you get up in the morning, you gotta go to work. That's gotta be in your mind. I'm not saying everyone can find a job. Oh, yeah. But the fact that you live in the country is not a reason not to have a job. Oh, it okay? is. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so there's nothing's going on here. You don't wanna be with him. It was a. Oh, I'm not putting words in your mouth. Is that true? No, I don't want him. He's broke. Okay. <laughs> you got that right. Okay. That right. So you, you two going to stay together? You two going to stay together? I don't know. I don't know if I can trust him. We'll be back. If you think that was wild and crazy, then click here to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is click here. And one more thing. Take care of yourself and each other.